This is my Walking Dead bedroom. Damn, finally got one. Hell yeah. It only took about nine years. <laughs> 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 Alright, well, I actually gotta say something though. You know, nobody has lived in this house for about two years. What do you mean, two by two years? I mean, nobody's lived here for the past two years. I'm the first one. So? That doesn't mean anything. There's more to it. The reason why is because two years ago, somebody was actually murdered in this house. No, I don't believe those fake okay. uh, theories. And... Just just listen, okay? The, the woman that was murdered, her name was Annabelle Higgins, okay? And I guess some guy broke into her house. I guess he grabbed a mask that she had. Grabbed one of her eyes, snuck up behind her, and killed her. Some some guy named Michael Myers or something. No, people can fake that. Okay, well, there's this is obviously not fucking fake because I saw actual evidence to it. What is the evidence? There's still some blood on the carpet from two years ago. It's faded, but there's a little bit of blood that's obviously still on the carpet. Don't try to say it's ketchup or some other red liquid. I can tell that it's blood. I know blood when I see it. Well, it could be fake and, blood. And I've seen actual pictures of the murder scene. Not like literally full pictures of her dead body, but I've seen parts of her dead body in some pictures and stuff in this house. When I came in this house, that house was completely empty, but in the closet I found two things that was there on the crime scene. No. This doll was in the closet when I moved in here. But this wasn't the only doll that was in here. Why do you have a doll? It was in here when I moved in. And I also have one of those very popular good guy dolls. Why do you have that? I told you it was in the closet when I moved in. See, it's one of those popular good guy dolls. You remember these things from the yeah. 80s? How popular they were? Actually, I actually have to try this out. See if it still works. You don't know if it works or not? No, I haven't opened it yet. It was in the closet in the box. I say something it would to be better than that. Just say something to her or something. Hey, bitch. What's up, man? Hi, I'm Chucky, and I'm your friend Juliet. Hiding home. <laughs> Still works. After all these years. So, that's just a... The, that's not... That's just a doll. That's a doll. Yeah, I understand, but... These were there on the crime scene when that woman was murdered. So you're saying she owned both of these? Yeah. I don't know why this was still in the box, but yeah, these were two of her dolls. I've seen actual pictures of them. I looked up more of the story. The guy, Michael Myers, who I guess he's the one who killed her. 1963, on Halloween night, he murdered his sister, Judith Myers. And she's buried in the cemetery at Haddonfield, Illinois. You remember my vacation to Haddonfield last yeah. week? Yeah. I went to the cemetery that she was supposed to be buried at, and guess what? I just so happened to see the actual tombstone. Judith Myers. Okay, it doesn't mean it, it goes with Michael, Michael Myers. Michael Myers kept escaping from institutions, looking for his sister, Lori Strode, and many, year, many years ago, he actually succeeded at killing Lori. I think that was like 40 years ago or something. He's been in a mental institution ever since. But just earlier, last month, on Halloween, he escaped. The bus crashed. So people can fake stuff. I've seen proof it was on the news. They showed us the crash bus. The news is fake. The news is not fake. Yes, it is. Oh my god, man. There's one more thing I need to tell you. A few days ago, it was like three miles down that way, I found a dead body. It's literally like... You pulling my leg here? No, it was literally like shanked to death by a knife. What type of knife? I don't know. Just a knife. You don't believe me, do you? No, I don't. I guarantee that body's still down there. You want to see? I doubt it is. All right. First thing tomorrow morning, I'm taking you down to where I saw that body. And if it's still there, that means I'm obviously telling the fucking truth. Well, it's... And the only person I can really think of it being is Michael Myers. No. It's not, he's not live. He's just a made up imaginary person. No. Keep believing this. You keep thinking I'm telling you a bunch of bullshit, but you're actually pissing me off right now.
You never believe a damn thing I say. Yeah. You know what? I'm gonna get to bed. First, like I said, you can stay the night, sleep on my couch or whatever. First thing in the morning, we're going down there. If you don't believe me, well, you're one of the biggest idiots I fucking know. Well, who knows who killed that person? That you saw? Fucking no. liars. Who else would it be? No one. Okay, so they just <laughs> randomly magically got knife wounds in their stomach? Yes. Okay, now you're just joking around. Whatever. I need to get to bed. Oh, good night. <laughs> Good night, man.